Ifunanya rest di alam. I can't say I was the first to see the body. I can only say I was the first to raise an alarm. But that is not best for my knowledge. It came as a shock to me. But we all tried our best to keep her alive. Anyone who would want to do this? Do what? Kill her, of course. Did you ask any other person this question? Why? Because I don't feel comfortable answering this question. And also, I didn't even know the deceased. I literally just met her yesterday. I've been away from home for a long time and this is a more reason why I should stay away from home. Did you see or hear anything? No. Are you sure? I won't be answering your question if I were deaf. Seem to have more injuries than the victim. No, they just are normal blood, sir. Of course. If it's yours, you won't be answering my questions. You medic? Sir? Doctor, nurse. Any? A doctor, sir. You were trying to revive the victim. Well, you know, you know that could. Um, God is the one that saves person. Uh, we treat and um, God heals. Do mm. you recall any? No, nothing unusual. No, nothing, nothing unusual. Of course, you won't recall. You're still under shock. Please, when you remember anything, call my attention to it. Mm? Mm? Okay. Mm. I'll do so. Suspicious, plus it's to put up a treat. The killer, he or she might just be around the corner. Lottering <laughs> around, looking for whoever that have information. Oh, wait, wait. Who do you think did it? Because I'm very sure that an external person will not come into this compound to kill someone. I don't know. Even nobody saw this coming. But it's here now. This is the case every one of us we, we, we saw. Maybe what scares me the most is that the killer might just be around the corner. And that is the main reason we need to find out who did this and why. I can't really say. But wait, we will stop on during the party. Did the TV for Nana? We all know that Thomas was at, 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 at the party. Every one of us was there. Huh. Was he really inside? Oh, I can see that your pregnancy hormones are really fighting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me get your pills. I'm just scared. I'm just scared. You don't need to be scared now. Let me just calm down and solve this case, okay? Okay. Just don't worry, okay? You'll be fine. You'll be fine, okay? <laughs> nah, nah, madam, picking the three down. Inspector, he, he named her Daniel. In the good doctor school. Necessary to bother them with that information. But if it is, I will leave them a text when necessary. I still think we should tell them though. Nah, it's not necessary. See you later. Hey, it's better. Heading somewhere. Wow, oh, it's a pleasant surprise to see you here. Dr. Daniel. You seem to be in a hurry. Emergency. 
No, 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 no emergency. But I have to be going though. So I will ask Martha to fix you up something to drink. Oh. May I, may I spread the rest in the bottom of the Lord? Um, at the sea. Please, pick something up when you sweat of the drink. And tell mom and dad that he's here to see them. Yeah, I'm here. I'll be going. I'll you soon. Here to see me. Yes, Doctor. Wow. What is it? Hey, what is it, Vivi? I think your brother is guilty. What, what, what do you mean by that? He's with Aziz. He's with Aziz? Yeah. In the sitting room, your brother is shaking. The guilty kind of shaking. Daniel? Yes. How? Oh. He, he was about leaving before his better caught him. Can you describe the surroundings and the conditions of the crime scene? What time was that? That she saw it first. So on getting to the crime, on uh, getting to the scene, we saw mother in a pool of blood stabbed on her neck. Examination from the morgue revealed someone tried to remedy the situation. You know, some first aid shenanigans. Yes, um, that must be me. Did anyone else perform first aid on her? No, no. No one did. I did everything alone. Okay. Still under examination at the morgue. Revealed that the wound was badly handled. The knife was roughly removed. And that caused tears and intense bleeding. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's all coming back to me now. Um, I, didn't, I did not do it alone. With your female doctor. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> I know I uh, I quickly had to rush in to get something so I had her to see um, put pressure on the wound while I got back I'm the caregiver here and I've been working for five years How close were you with the disease? We were very close there were no kids of her age here, no girls for her to relate with, so we relate more like sisters. So you helped Dr. Daniel perform first aid on her? You're right. He said he needed to go inside, so I helped him apply pressure on the wound. And I also helped him get some other things he used. Other things like what? Like alcohol and water. Yeah, that person you know that has dangerous motives. No. So I know someone who doesn't seem to like her. Patricia. We have been on loggerheads since she got here. Fighting? Not really. They don't just get along, and Patricia seems to hate her so much. Why, if I may ask? So, wait, wait, now. Wait, when? when do you think you're going? I don't understand. The detective said nobody should leave this house. 
one to go have medical exam. And I cannot miss that medical exam because one cook is lying cold in the mall. I have to go. Daniel, why will you say a thing like that? Eh? Matter is just. Matter what, mom? Matter what? She's not in the past. Even at that, show a little respect. Ah! Oh, I'm I have to go. I really have to go. What? What's going on here? Daniel, where are you going? Asani. See, nobody leaves this house without the permission of the detective or myself. Someone dies here without explanations, and you think it is a joke? Look, is that what you think? Any little mistake we make here, everyone will end up in jail. I don't seem to understand how all this is necessary. If you must go, call the detective. My friend, drop that bag. Fine, I'll call him. Baby, yes. your brother is hasn't strength. He still hasn't left. <laughs> this is getting serious. Right? Yes. Something is wrong. What if a mistake happened during the first air treatment? And that was a contributing factor to matter demise. Maybe he knew. And he wants to avoid questions about the pain they take on him. Hey, that doesn't make that man a I never said he did. I said, what if a mistake happened? It doesn't make him the one who committed the offense. Huh. Someone stopped Martha. And that is where it all began. Don't you have a medical exam to write? Yes, I do. Why? You sit like a child on holiday. Dr. Daniel. Yes, doctor. Before you leave, your school will have to send you a letter off. What do you mean letter? How will we ensure you're a medical doctor? It's what I am a medical student. You first said doctor. Because he started calling me that and I never knew it mattered. Wound improved from the medical school because injuries from the stabbed wound revealed it was badly handled. Something a medical student would have. Yeah, I don't want to go to jail. Yes, I don't want to go to jail, please. Yes, but I don't want to go to jail. Please. I don't want to go to jail. Dad. Mom. I'm going to be sorry. Sorry for what? I am not a medical doctor. Hey! Hey! Mother and I a student of medicine. Daniel! Yes, Mom. Mom. <laughs> it's my passion for. Art and culture that made me to stop spoiling it. Time now. Oh, sorry. Dad, you are not a medical student. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, Dad. Dad, please. Dad. Oh, Dad, Dad. Dad, I'm sorry, Dad. Don't touch me. Oh, I'm sorry. Time now. How could you? All these years, you fooled all of us. Mom, it's passion for art and culture. I'm sorry. 
Daniel, why? Mom, I'm sorry. Why? Mom, I'm sorry. Mom, please forgive me. Mom, please. Mom, I'm sorry. Ah. I am beyond disappointed. Very, very disappointed. And I'm sorry. You're sorry? I'm really Daniel, sorry. Why, why did you let us tell everybody that our son is going to be a medical doctor? What kind of embarrassment is that? Can you imagine that? Yeah. You should have saved us this embarrassment now. Uh, that's why I said I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, Daniel. <gasps> look, look, look. Your pretense is over. <laughs> totally over. You have to get your apology talks together. Get it ready because you have a lot of it to do to the authority. Ah, Dad. Yes. No, Dad. It has not go to the level. Dad, I'm sorry. Mom, please. Eh? Please help me. I'm begging. Eh, Mom, please. I'm sorry. Eh? Daniel, what do you want me to do? Mom, please help me. I'm begging. Not the authorities. Can you please allow me one matter in peace? Mom, I'm sorry. Please. Please, Dad. Please. Hey, Dad. Mom, not the authorities. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Dad. Mom. said anything concerning the pregnancy. No mm -hmm. shaking at all for now. Hmm? I think we are safe. We are okay. No wala. But what about the remaining views? I trashed it in the kitchen. Ah, hey, 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 hey. Hope they are safe there. Of course they are. Nobody goes to the kitchen anyway. Ah. They are too busy for that. We are sure. We are sure. No wala. Give this go. Go to the room. Take down. Take this way. Thank <laughs> you. 